All right. Let her have. I'm gonna make you squeal like a piggy. All right. Time to deal with Leatherhead, the cartoon version, because Leatherhead in the comics and uh, newer cartoons was more faithfully seen as being, uh, well, basically, real Leatherhead is a very intelligent mutant scientist. Like, you know, he's just a mutant crocodile scientist. Nothing wrong with that. He's not some kind of southern hick beast. Although I don't mind either version. But he still doesn't beat Doc Croc. Does anyone, anyone who's British, anyone remember a show back on CITV called, um, um, uh, Round the Bend? Not Round the Twist, that was a show that came later. Round the Bend. It was about a, oh my god, he beat me. Damn it, he punches hard. I don't know if that was the last continue or not, but we're gonna have to deal with some nasty tricks here. Okay, let's go. Holy crap, that, that was a great combo. Yeah, that was that was totally planned. I, I totally meant to do that. I just remembered to do it now. So yeah, when I was saying there was a show called Round the Twist, it was a very obscure little show that ITV had in Britain. And it was about a guy in the sewers called Doc Croc. He was literally a Dr. Crocodile. And fuck off, shurikens, because fuck your shurikens. Fucking shurikens! Anyways, Doc Clark had a, uh, had a bunch of rats, and it was basically a children's sketch show, making really bad parodies of things. And I loved the hell out of it, because it was an awesome show, and it had a very damn awesome English crocodile. Yeah, that was it. I just wanted to give you a little glimpse into the obscure parts of British animation. I'm going to batter you off, off screen, because you don't deserve anything. Oh, thank God! Ha ha ha! I knew it! I have anticipated your attacks! Ah! Oh, what? Ah! No, no, don't dick me like this! Ah! I don't know how that worked. A lot of things exploded and they were generally in your direction. Ow! What the hell? We're not even done yet. Normally this would be the second to last level, but no, the SNES version has one extra surprise for you. Which is awesome of Konami to give their, the, the, uh, the quality-wise inferior game something. Anyways, now we'll be able to deal with Leatherhead. Anyways, Leatherhead only seems to like to take three hits. You want to make them count. Really, I find the Leatherhead is the easiest boss. I just got unlucky that time. Next to, of course, Raymond Baxter. Oh, okay, I'm gonna beat her now. His worst attack is the tail attack, because there's no way you're going to stop that. Yeah, see? Just out of nowhere, you're going to get hit by that. When all those fails, jump kick!
It might work. Oh, that. Oh. I'll just die already. God damn it. Hey, let's kick him off. Sorry, Doctor. I guess you have to go back for your PhD.